Hold on to your seats, folks. We have an urgent matter to discuss, low blood pressure. Now you might be thinking, isn't high blood pressure the real issue? Well, while high blood pressure is a concern, low blood pressure can be just as dangerous, causing dizziness, fainting, and in severe cases, even shock. But fear not, we're here to navigate these choppy waters together. We've got a lifeline with 10 home remedies that can help keep your blood pressure on an even keel. These remedies are backed by scientific research and are easy to incorporate into your daily routine. But before we dive into this ocean of knowledge, do us a favor. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Our channel is a treasure trove of helpful content just like this, and we wouldn't want you to miss a thing. Stay tuned as we dive deep into the world of home remedies for low blood pressure. First on the list is salt. Yes, you heard right. Medical research has shown that adding a slightly higher amount of salt to your diet can help raise your blood pressure. According to the Journal of Hypertension Studies, sodium plays a key role in regulating blood pressure. Daily salt consumptions depending on your blood pressure reading, a low blood pressure reading can consume at least six grams per day. But remember, moderation is key and always consult your doctor before making any drastic dietary changes. Next up, we have hydration. Ensuring an adequate intake of fluids, including water, herbal teas, and electrolyte-rich beverages is essential. Coconut water in particular can be beneficial due to its electrolyte content. Dehydration can lead to a drop in blood pressure and staying hydrated helps maintain your blood volume, thereby preventing blood pressure from dropping too low. Third in our list is leg elevation. It may seem simple, but lying down and elevating your legs can actually help improve blood flow to the brain. A study in the British Journal of Clinical Pharmacology showed that this technique can help increase blood pressure in people with hypotension. Coming in at number four, we have caffeine. Drinking a cup of coffee or tea can provide a temporary increase in blood pressure. Research published in the European Journal of Clinical Nutrition suggests that caffeine blocks a hormone that keeps your arteries widened, causing your blood pressure to increase. Finally, we round up the first half of our list with relaxation practices. Techniques such as yoga and deep breathing exercises have been shown to promote relaxation and regulate blood pressure. A study in the Journal of Alternative and Complementary Medicine even found that regular yoga practice can help improve blood pressure stability. Hold your curiosity, we have more remedies to explore. Moving on, let's talk about the power of beetroot juice. A study published in the Journal of Nutritional Science suggests that beetroot juice contains high levels of dietary nitrate, which the body converts into nitric oxide. This compound helps widen blood vessels, improving blood flow and regulate blood pressure. However, individuals with kidney issues should be cautious due to the high oxalate content. Next up is the humble basil. You might know it as a staple in your kitchen, but it's also a potential remedy for low blood pressure. The Journal of Ethnopharmacology reports that eugenol, a compound found in basil, can affect the body's endothelial function, which regulates blood pressure. So, a cup of basil tea might be just what the doctor ordered. Now, let's explore the world of aromatherapy. Rosemary essential oil has been used for centuries for its therapeutic properties. A study in the Journal of Herbal Medicine suggests that rosemary oil can stimulate the cardiovascular system, helping to regulate blood pressure. So, the next time you need a pick-me-up, why not try a few drops of rosemary oil in your diffuser? Let's not forget the importance of regular exercise. Whether it's a brisk walk, a swim, or a bike ride, physical activity helps increase blood flow and heart rate, which in turn can raise blood pressure. The Journal of Hypertension found that moderate aerobic exercise can have a positive effect on blood pressure levels. Finally, consider adjusting your eating habits. Consuming smaller, more frequent meals throughout the day can help prevent sudden drops in blood pressure after meals, according to the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition. So instead of three large meals, try five or six smaller ones. Impressive, isn't it? But that's not all we have for you today. Now that we've armed you with this knowledge, it's your turn to take action. We've journeyed through the realm of home remedies for low blood pressure, exploring 10 effective strategies that you can implement right in the comfort of your own home. Remember, adding a pinch more salt to your meals can give your blood pressure that little nudge it needs. Staying hydrated with water and electrolyte-rich beverages is not just about quenching thirst. It's about maintaining balance in your body. 
When you're feeling a bit lightheaded, lie down and elevate your legs. It's a simple act that can significantly improve blood flow to your brain. A cup of coffee or tea can provide a temporary boost to your blood pressure. But remember, nothing beats the power of relaxation techniques like yoga and deep breathing exercises. They are a gentle yet powerful way to regulate your blood pressure. Ever thought of beetroot juice as a health elixir? Now's the time to start. Basil tea is not just a soothing brew. It could be the answer to your low blood pressure woes. The aromatic allure of rosemary essential oil is more than just a treat for your senses. It can stimulate your cardiovascular system too. Don't underestimate the power of regular exercise. Even a leisurely walk or a swim can do wonders. And lastly, remember the value of smaller, more frequent meals in preventing sudden drops in blood pressure. We hope you found this information useful. Your experiences matter to us. So, do share your personal stories related to low blood pressure. How have you managed it? Have you tried any of these remedies? Your insights could help someone else navigating the same journey. Don't forget to hit the like button if you found this video helpful and subscribe to our channel for more health conscious content.